to post a video using the social planner and posting to YouTube long-term videos or shorts, here are the steps. Once inside the social planner, make sure that you have your YouTube channel selected in the channel selector. These post story and reels would not apply when you're using and posting to YouTube. The next section will allow you to put in the details below the video. This is the video description area. Filling this out will fill in the details below your YouTube video. You can make sure to add any designs, emojis, hashtags, or tags below. Keep in mind that certain YouTube channels must meet certain restrictions or details in order to post URLs, and you will have to make sure that that is confirmed on the YouTube side at this time. Next, to upload your content, you'll go here to the video icon. Click on the video icon, find the video that you'd like to post, select it, and preview it on the right hand side. Now that you can see the video, you may be wondering, well, how do I choose a thumbnail? Below, you will see a thumbnail that is automatically chosen. Click on that small icon, and you can slide through several pre selected thumbnails. Or, if you'd like, click on custom thumbnail and upload your own thumbnail. For now, we will select this icon, click Save Changes, and you can see a preview of your thumbnail for the YouTube video. Below this, there's a couple of selectable YouTube options. First is the title. When you fill in the title, you'll be able to preview what it looks like on the right-hand side. Last but not least, there's the privacy level, whether or not this is a public, a private, or an unlisted video on YouTube. You can also post a follow-up comment. This will automatically go live below the YouTube video from your account. Next, let's switch the post type from video to short. In this case, we'll see an icon and an error that says the video is not supported because of the aspect ratio. You will still see a preview on the right hand side. However, you will need to click on this icon, go ahead and trash that video, and go and find a video that is the correct aspect ratio. All the rest of the steps are very similar. You can choose your thumbnail, fill in any of the content types, adjust your title, and just like any other social planner details, the last step and options you have are to save for later or to post. Clicking this drop down will allow you to post now, schedule the post, send it for approval for other users, schedule recurring post, or delete.